Okay, so today I'm going to try and do this chocolate bomb that I got at Dollar Tree and I heated up. We didn't have uh, fresh milk, so I went ahead and used almond milk. So I'm sure it'll taste just as good. So this is the one that is the peppermint flavored chocolate and inside is the like mini the mini marshmallows in there bear with me i'm trying to do this with one hand but um i wanted to show it on camera from beginning to end so i've already heated the milk up in the microwave you can also do it um in your like heat the pan up but i don't want it to burn the milk so this is how you would pop it in there and we'll just videotape it and see it, what it looks like on camera. I would love to be able to make one of these. So here we go. Let's hope. Now it's not popping open yet, but let's give it a quick stir and see. Last time I tried to do it, I didn't have the milk hot enough. So sorry for the shadow. So see the chocolate starting to melt. Yeah, I did, I, did, I did it again. I forgot to heat up. I put the milk in there for a minute and a half about. So basically you would want to have your milk a little bit hotter than this. And then you just continue to stir. And it's supposed to like, all of a sudden, like a bomb. Open up. <laughs> Pop open, but it's not doing it. It's a pretty thick chocolate. So let's just give it a few more stirs and see if it'll pop open for us on camera. Okay. My nose is so dry here in the house, right? Because it's so cold outside. I'm supposed to have warmer days this coming week. Out in the 50s. Oh, there it goes. Did you see that? <laughs> you can reverse it. It put, finally popped open. Last time I did do it, it didn't pop open on camera. So maybe do, depending on your microwave, maybe heat up the milk one minute 35, one minute 40. And then you just keep stirring. should pop open for you maybe right when you drop the chocolate bomb in. So I'm gonna finish stirring this up and enjoy my hot chocolate. Thanks for watching. Bye.